Welcome to Edupedia World. In this video, we will discuss about graphic location of mode and relationship between mean, median and mode. First, we come to graphic location of mode. The value of mode can also be located graphically. We use histogram to identify mode with the help of graphs. The following steps are involved in calculating mode graphically. First, we prepare a histogram from the given set of data. Second, model class is identified from the highest rectangle. In other words, the rectangle with the maximum height is the model class. Third, we draw two lines, one joining the top right point of the rectangle preceding the model class with the top right point of the model class and fourth point the other joining the top left point of the model class with the top left point of the post model class next step we get a point of intersection that is point e of these two diagonal lines Next, from this point E, we will draw a perpendicular on the horizontal axis, x-axis and the point F give us the value of mode. Now, let us understand this with the help of an example that we will discuss in the next slide. We have to find out mode graphically using the data given below. And we will verify the results by using the formula to calculate mode. In the data we have provided with wages and number of workers. First, we will draw a graph and plot the data on it. We will prepare a histogram from the given set of data. We have discussed earlier that model class is identified from the highest rectangle. As you can see on the graph that highest rectangle is of 25 which comes under class interval of 200 to 300. Now we will draw two lines, one joining the top right point of the rectangle proceeding to the top right point of the model class. That is preceding class intervals are 100 to 200. So one line will be joining to that one. And the next lining that is top left point of the model class with the top left point of the model class, which comes under 300 to 400 as you can see in the graph. Now what we got? We got a point of intersection that is point E. Now from point E we will draw a perpendicular on the horizontal axis X and what we will get? We will get point F and F is the value of mode. We can verify this by using formula. The formula of mode is Z equals to L1 plus F1 minus F0 whole divided by 2 F1 minus F0 minus F2 multiplied by I. Now we will put the data under it and we will calculate it. After calculation you will get rupees 260 as mode. So you can see that graphically and with the formula mode is the same. So hence verified. Now next we come to relationship among mean, median and mode. Relationship among mean, median and mode will depend on type of distribution that is symmetrical or asymmetrical distribution. First we will discuss symmetrical distribution. If distribution is symmetrical, the values of mean, median and mode are equal. That is at point E, mean, median and mode is equal. And in this case, the frequency curve will be bell shaped. As you can see in the diagram, that mode touches the peak of the curve indicating maximum frequency. Median divides the area of the curve in two equal halves and mean is the center of gravity. 
it is formed in a bell shaped this is a symmetrical distribution next we come to a symmetrical distribution in actual life most of the distributions are not symmetrical if distribution is asymmetrical the values of mean median and mode will be different in this case the frequency curve will not be bell shaped as it was in symmetrical distribution that is the height of the curve is not in the middle a symmetrical distribution may be skewed either to the right that is positively skewed or to the left that is negatively skewed if it is a positively skewed distribution most of the values of variables fall to the right of mode in other words mode is the minimum the relative magnitude of these three measures would be mean greater than median greater than mode as you can see in the diagram that mean is greater than median and mode it is a positively skewed curve which falls right of the mode if it is a negatively skewed distribution most of the values would concentrate to the left of mode in other words mode is the maximum the relative magnitude of these three measures would be mean less than median less than mode as you can see in the graph that the frequency curve is concentrated to the left of the mode the relationship between mean median and mode can be given with the help of the following formula that is mode is equals to 3 median minus 2 mean or z equals to 3m minus 2x with a bar above it this formula is given by carl pearson it is specially useful to determine the value of mode when it is ill defined if we know any two of the three values the third can be estimated by using the formula the value so computed will be more or less same as obtained by using exact formula provided distribution is moderately asymmetrical let us understand this with the help of an illustration on the next slide in this particular illustration mode of an asymmetrical distribution is 370 and median is 300 we have to find out mean so we have discussed the formula in the earlier slide that is mode is equals to 3 median minus 2 mean in place of mode we will write 370 and in place of median we will write 300 after calculating it will get mean which is 265 with the help of this formula when two things are given whether mode median or mean we can find out one thing from this formula this shows the relationship among mean median and mode next we come to comparison among mean median and mode first mean and median are certain values but not the mode it is not so precise and accurate second it is difficult to calculate mode as compared to mean and median third mean is based on all the items in the series but median and mode are not based on all the items in the series fourth point algebraic treatment is possible with the help of mean median and mode are not useful for algebraic treatment fifth comparison mode is not affected by extremely small values median is slightly affected by extreme values mean is affected by extreme values to a great extent and the last comparison 
median and mode can be computed graphically mean cannot be computed graphically these are some of the comparisons between mean median and mode thank you for watching edupedia world videos